Hey guys, sorry about blowing up your inbox. That was not my intent. Um, just trying to adjust the settings better because when I watch my videos back, I can notice some little quirks like um, the pixelating and stuff like that. So I don't know if it's going to get any better. I've Jeff looked at it this morning and did a little adjusting for me. So just want to test it out. And I know you guys have requested some tutorials and I definitely want to do them for you. I just want to see if I can get rid of the pixelating issue before I do those and um, if not to be honest then this is as good as it's going to get and I'm not going to fuss with any more camera stuff as far as getting any more um, and I'm happy with the quality otherwise so I'm fine with it and hope you guys can live with it if that's the case but um, thought I would just do a quick face of the day and outfit of the day okay so on my face I'm wearing the Chobo Yang BB cream I'm still loving that um, I also have the Rachel K and I really love that too. It's a bit um, like more pale than I am right now. So the Chobo Yang is number two and it matches me really well um, for summer. So I'll probably just save the um, other one, the Rachel K, for when I kind of lose a little bit more color. This is a lot of color for me. I know it's like ridiculous because it's still like NC20, but that's how it goes. Um, Okay, let's see. I forgot some things, but I'll just tell you. The bronzer I'm using is um, the MAC Nude on Board, and the blush is MAC Highland Honey. Love those. And let's see, for eyes, I used the Stila palette, the Natural Eyes palette. And this is a hot mess. I hate to show this to you, but it's well loved. So I have on this color here, there we go. This one here, all on the lid and blended up to the brow. Um, then I mix these two here and just dust it a little bit on the lid and in the crease. And I've been into kind of like heavier makeup on the top and nothing on the bottom except for mascara, like on my lashes. I haven't been into the smudging lately or black in the waterline for some reason. I'm sure I'll get back to that, but little phase I'm going through. Um, and the liner, I have loved this liner since almost, gosh, I want to say my very first videos on YouTube. And it's the Fabi liner from Jordana. It's like $1.99 at Walgreens. And I still love it. I've tried other pens. I just really, really like this one. So, stays on really well. I have this on all the way from this area, really thick kind of, not really thick, but pretty thick, and then winged it out, I don't know if you can see that, and then I put black eyeshadow from this Guerlain palette, number 10, I'll put it everything in the description box too, but I just used the black and went over the line, kind of smudged it out a little bit, and um, I tend to have like watery eyes. I think I have allergy eyes. So especially if I'm putting any liner really close to the tear duct area, I like to go over that with powder just to make sure that it doesn't get all sloppy. And that really works out. The lashes I have on are the Ardell Self Adhesive 12 OS, I believe it is. And oh, my brows. I always forget to mention the brows. And I have been loving this duo from Anastasia. It's in the color Ebony. Wow, that's a hot mess too. And it has two colors in there, like a dark and um, dark brown and a medium brown. And it actually says, I think that this is the darkest powder that they have. Like if you have black hair, then this is what you want. And I always have loved darker brows. And sometimes I go through phases where I like it lighter and now I went back to my darker. So, and then this is the Anastasia uh, tinted brow gel and the sticker is gone but I think it is in the color espresso. I got those at Ulta and let's see the lip I have on is um, liner is Kiss Me Quick from MAC. I think this is a Pro Longwear. Yeah it's a Pro Longwear pencil. And I'm mostly swatching. I know I have it on but Jeff said one of the reasons the camera was pixelating was perhaps the autofocus, 
which I had it on autofocus and now we've taken it off. So I'm curious of how the camera is going to focus without it. So also the lipstick. This is a Tom Ford lipstick. What is the color? True Coral. And Lindsay sent this to me. It's beautiful. She's been wanting to see me in it, so I thought I'd wear it special for her today. And of course, I love that white packaging. The concealer I'm using is Max Prep and Prime. And Radiant Rose is the color. It's like a highlight clicky pen. Really like this. Um, when I use that, I also use it for kind of like brightening down my nose and other places like that. And I still do love this Age Rewind. You can see it's all the way down to here. I love both of those. Those are probably my two favorites. I feel like I'm forgetting something. I think that's it. I'll move on to jewelry and stuff. I'm going to do that first because, um, again, I always forget to mention or show you bracelet or whatever. So I'm just going to get that out of the way. This bracelet is from Brighton. It just has different um, colored little Jimmy beads all the way around. I've had this for years. I love that. The ring I have on is uh, Tiffany's mesh ring. And this necklace is also from Brighton. Another one of my favorites. Had that for a long time. My earrings I have on. Um, I finally put some earrings in here. I have two other holes besides this one. So I just have like a little diamond and a little um, pearly earring here that I just always keep in until I lose it and then I have to get more, which always happens. Um, but these, I change these out like every day. And the ones I've been wearing a lot, I got these recently and they're from Dillard's. And gosh, I can't remember. I think it was, I want to say Ralph Lauren. But yeah, they're really cute, and that's how it closes right there. So yeah, I love that, and I will show you the outfit. Okay, so I have on this tank top, and I think it was a gift a long time ago. I've had it for a while. It's very um, roughly all the way around, and I have on these MC Hammer pants. I love these. They are ginormous. Look at the bottom. It's hilarious. I love it. They're so comfortable, obviously and got these at Target and I really like them. I love that they are like super high-waisted. The tank top, I actually rolled it to, it's really long and it's too big and frilly to tuck in. If I have a thinner shirt, I would usually tuck something in like this where it's high-waisted. So I just rolled it and the material that it is, it stays, it kind of just flares out a little bit. Looks like I have 10 more pounds, but that's okay. And the shoes, let me see if I can show you. I had a hard time getting the angle of the shoes, so I will just take it off for you and show you. These are Steve Madden. Those cute, I love that little bow. I think Jeff got me these for Christmas. So yeah, just gonna go shopping with my mom today. She's headed over and we're just gonna hang out. We usually go to lunch and run some errands, stuff like that. So that's what we're up to. I hope you guys have a really fun day and Thanks for putting up with um, me blowing up your inbox. Bye, guys.